Now it should be okay. Okay, now it should be okay. Oh, good morning to everyone. It's Thursday, first week of May. Um, let's see what Bitcoin is doing very quickly. Uh, so the weekly was looking bearish um, but not convincingly bearish because we can continue to the upside here so uh, the daily now has bullish signs after the Fed decision so they cut rates uh, 25 basis points as uh, I think everyone expected this um, no, no surprises there uh, on the daily we see that the money flow is going up and we have this momentum also picking up picking to the upside green dot um, so it's it might be probable that we break this uh, finally this 30.5 resistance but uh, we don't know for sure so until we break it I would suggest not uh, not having any um, huge long positions but if we break it successfully, yes, then I would say we need to be positioned uh, for the bull market if we break this. I'm still hoping to get a lower price, but this might not happen. Uh, I think a lot of people are hoping to get a lower price so they can buy and position themselves for the new bull market. but. Uh, we may not get this and just continue to the upside now seeing the one hour uh, it looks like uh, there is some bearish divergence on the momentum uh, right here and we we might be um, going down from here I'm not sure if this will happen we will have to monitor the situation and because the 45 minute see wave is going up mm. so it uh, bitcoin has mixed signals on different time frames so on the 30 minute uh, we have a green um, momentum so it's a mixed signals uh, between the different time frames i would definitely wait for some resolution to see what happens uh, let's see the Chimoku cloud. So on the 30 minute actually uh, for me um, short position from here is more probable to the Tenkan Sen at 28.7 or 28.5 uh, but the risk reward is too small. I think I'm, I'm not considering this trade right now. Um, we're in the upper Bollinger but we're starting to break the Chimoku cloud. So if we uh, consistently break it and stay above it it would be very bullish let's see the six hour so really some bullish signs for bitcoin yes so we are keeping on the six hour above the tank uh, above the tank and send but we are basically in the cloud here so the price action would be choppy as it is uh, so we have to wait uh, yeah this uh, resistance if we don't break it, uh, we might go down a little bit more to grab some liquidity. So I'm not hurry uh, for a position. Uh, we're beautifully uh, getting supported by uh, by the Chimoku cloud on the daily, uh, and we'll see what happens next. It is interesting because we have been consolidating for quite uh, for quite a while and there there should be some resolution soon to the upside or to the downside uh, the cloud here is thick so i think uh, we might get more bullish action if we start breaking this 30.5k this is on the very high time frame on the 30 minute mm, i would say nothing for now let's see the one hour yeah, th the one hour is a little bit bearish, so I'm maybe we, we can do a um, short scalp, uh, but very small scalp with very uh, small risk reward ratio, I think until 28,500. Uh, I don't, 
I don't think it's worth it right now. Uh, the four hour is still going up, so yeah, if we go in a short, uh, the, the four hour might just uh, continue to the upside and wreck us. So keep this in mind. That's why I'm not doing anything right now. Yeah, here the same story. Um, It looks more bullish than bearish to me, to be honest. Let's see uh, here the CVD and the funding. Mm, the CVD and the funding. Okay. So this is one hour, let's see the 30 minute and the 30 minute is uh, definitely like very high funding rate it has come down a little bit mm, but still I don't like uh, such high uh, funding rate it's more more probable than not to, um, to go down from here Bitcoin to go down and uh, if the funding was positive, yes, maybe I will uh, want this, but it's a uh, uh, no trade for now, neutral zone. Open interest is going up and for CVD, yeah, we have a little bit to the upside, uh, but not much. And in general, the CVD and the Delta looks like uh, we will have a new move to the upside but the question is whether we are going to have it immediately or after some consolidation to the downside so this is my two cents i i'm waiting i'm doing nothing right now uh, this 30 minute is uh, it's neutral a little bit more bullish but we have divergence here so um, no i'm not uh, I'm not considering any trade for now. Um, we have to see if we start going up more. Maybe I'll consider a short scalp, but for now the risk reward is too small for me. And the 15 minute is still going up, so we have to wait for it. Also the 30 minute. Yeah, that's that's my my two cents. Have a good day.